Mr. Hines uh, subforce for a time, and uh, um, during that uh, subbing, uh, you know, he showed uh, very good safety. Loiza Muscatine Superintendent Mike Van Sickle says Ricky Hines was hired back in 2013. He was a substitute driver in the spring and did a good enough job that he earned a regular route in the fall. If people uh, show good consistency and safety in the sub realm, then of course that's someone that we're also going to uh, consider. Hines passed the background check the school district is required to do. Iowa's law mandates school districts look at court records. Records TV6 investigates checked show Hines has nine traffic violations dating back to 1994. Were those red flags? TV6 investigates asked Superintendent Van Sickle. There has not been anybody that's applied uh, that we've actually hired <laughs> that has had uh, a uh, something that, quote, I could not live with or that showed up. Some of Hines' prior convictions include operating without a registration, disobeying a traffic sign, and lacking financial liability coverage. The Iowa DOT told us none of those prior convictions threaten his commercial driver's license. In fact, the DOT told us half of the violations have fallen off Hines' driving record. Most of the normal uh, traffic violations will stay on a record for five years. The DOT's Dennis Clean says the only issue threatening Hines' commercial driver's license are his two school bus accidents. They happened within a six-month period. If he has another accident in any vehicle through May... At that point, he could be considered a habitual violator, which is three or more moving violations in a 12-month period, and at that point he could be suspended. A suspension would invalidate his commercial driver's license, barring him from driving a school bus. Hines resigned his job with the school district in December, although his CDL is still valid. Superintendent Van Sickle says Hines passed all the tests and his background check with no issues when he was hired. As far as the first school bus accident, the parked car incident back in May. That was not uh, uh, a huge uh, infraction, in, in, in my opinion. Hines declined an on-camera interview when TV6 reached him by phone. He did say he was very sorry about the November accident, and he says seeing any school bus on the road tears him apart.